truly enjoy in my ventures here in Florida and elsewhere throughout our great republic is seeing people like yourselves who are just not taking it anymore. Who are t basically telling the government that they can take what they're doing and shove it up their own backsides. Because we're getting sick and tired, I'm sick and tired of what this government has been doing to us and against us. They used to do things to us. Now they are officially going rogue and working against us. And this is totally an anathema to what my dad used to talk to me about. Oh, by the way, how do you like my choice of fashion this evening? <laughs> You know, they're talking about the women getting together and the, the, this wonderful t-shirt. Yeah, one of the things that had made this country great, having the great women that were behind the great, in many cases, beside the great men, and you can go all the way back to the Revolutionary War. Uh, for example, John, Ad John Adams' wife. We all have read about his great story, but I doubt if he would have done as well as he did had he not had his great wife by his side, who was his great advisor and mentor and in many cases. And uh, so just, I thank God for you, for the women of America who are stepping, stepping out there and sometimes filling in and doing a better job than we men do. And uh, thank God for all of you. Um, a, lot, a lot of people ask me, they say, well, Ron, and sometimes I find this insulting and sometimes I don't, depends on my mood. I'll say, what are you, a black man, why, why do you care so much about this country? What, what's, what say you about all this? Well, why shouldn't I? Wasn't I born here too? Yeah. I'm a black man, I was born here in America. And by the way, if anyone walks up to me and calls me an African American, I'm gonna do something to you. <laughs> I'm gonna sick my public relations agent on you. And she will lecture you for about a half an hour about why you should not call me an African American. Okay. But I'll tell you in one sentence, because I was born here in America. That's and that's right. it. I'm as much of an American as you are.